Hey, Big Spring, it's Vince. And I'm Emily. And this is your Channel 3 News. The University of Pittsburgh is offering the Bridge College Prep and Leadership Academy, which is a dynamic summer program designed to help rising high school juniors and seniors prepare for their future. The Bridge was developed to help students gain an, a competitive edge in the college application process, get accepted to college of their choice, and make the most of their co college experience. The program runs from July 12th to 17th, and the deadline to register is June 1st. If you need more information, please visit this website. Cornerstone is offering two scholarships for seniors. Check it out. Money! Money, 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 money! This is a reminder to those that signed up to take a hack dual enrollment course for next year. Applications and supporting materials are due to the counseling office no later than May 1st. Reminder, all students interested in applying to student council for next school year need to complete your application by May 1st. Please check your emails for more information and a link to the application. Postgrad 2015. Seniors, today is the last day to submit pictures for the senior video given at Postgrad. All childhood, current, group, funny, senior, etc. pictures are wanted. Applications are now available for club care during the 2015 to 2016 school year. If you are interested, you can pick one up with Ms. Doherty in room 350. They are due back by May 15th. And now over to Anna with your sports. And I'm a ghost, and I'm here with your Channel 3 Sports. Last night in sports, JV Baseball lost 4-0 to East Penn, but JV Softball beat East Penn 15-0. Varsity Softball also beat East Penn 11-2, and Varsity Baseball lost East Penn 7-1. Tonight in sports, Varsity Baseball will be playing home against Boiling Springs at 4-15, and JV Baseball will, playing, will be playing at Boiling Springs at 4-30. Varsity Softball will also be playing at Boiling Springs at 4.30 and JV Softball is here at home against Boiling Springs at 5.15. Juniors and seniors are reminded to check their emails for Powder Puff updates. Don't you ever say I just want you. I came in like a rat. High School will be hosting an ARC lifeguarding class and a lifeguarding CPR class. Both will be held in the month of May and are heavily discounted for Big Spring students. For more information, you can contact Terry Young, the Aquatics Director, at 717-243-2525, extension 210, or you can contact Mr. Gillette. That's all from me, and now to Cody with your weather. <laughs> Hey guys, guess what day it is? Come on, guess what day it is? My, 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 my. Hey Mike, guess what day it is? Um, hump day? Oh yeah! This is Cody the Combo, here with your weather. Today will be partly cloudy with a mile of high of 70 degrees. Today will be increasing clouds with a low of 50 degrees. More sunshine with Rico winds today with other steady late April afternoon high highs will be near 70 degrees truly a nice day of for the weather at Central PA now back to your news students who sold Yankee candles and Tupperware in the software sophomore class fundraiser. Delivery is slated for Wednesday, May 6th in the Commons area from 3 to 5 p.m. 
Please make arrangements to pick up your orders at that time or plan to take them home on the bus. See Ms. Doherty if you have questions. Looking for a used car? Cornerstone is having a two-day enterprise car sales event at their Eastgate Drive location in Carlisle. Come get the perfect used car package and a 1% rate discount. Come May 1st at 10 a.m. through 6 p.m. or May 2nd at 9 a.m. through 1 p.m. Rho Kappa National Social Studies Honor Society is looking for juniors and sophomores. Check out your emails for the application. You need four social studies credits by the end of this school year and a total of six by graduation. 20 hours of community service are required per year after induction. A 3.0 GPA, teacher recommendation, and a completed application turned into Ms. Whitmoyer, room 311, by May 6, 2015. Questions? Please see Mrs. Whitmoyer. Looking for something fun to do during lunch? Check out this video for details on a special event hosted by the Theater Club. Hi Big Spring, this is Kara and Emily, and we're about to take a look at the Theater Club Festival. The theme of the festival is dark. Dark comedy, dark stories, and a more thrilling tone. Let's take a look at some of these performances in the making. Students participating have the option to either write their own scripts, find one online, or do a short monologue. So, Emily, I heard that you were in the Theater Club Festival. Yeah. Can I ask you what your performance is about? Yeah, um, I'm performing a monologue. I won't tell you what monologue for a surprise, but... Um, I can tell you right now, three girls are doing monologues and the rest of the group, they're doing um, like small performances and it should be a lot of fun. Um, our performance is of like a small 50s kind of old time um, play and it was written in for adults but we kind of rewrote it to fit our teenage style. Our performance is of a dramatic version of Alice in Wonderland. Our performance is a basic murder mystery. Did you write your own script? No, no. I found mine online. Um, a lot of the groups, a few of the groups actually did write their own. I know one wrote a murder mystery, so that's kind of cool. Um, kind of. We took it from a site, but um, they kind of lent it out to us and stuff, and we kind of just rewrote the script and stuff. It's pretty cool. It's a pretty basic play. Uh, actually, yes, our script was written by a one named Caraway. Part do you play in your show? Um, I play this guy named Brad, who kind of likes this girl. But the girl thinks he's kind of like a girlyish guy and stuff, so he she pretty much dumps him right on the spot. It's pretty. I play the Mad Hatter. I play the part of a girl named Harley, based off of Harley Quinn from Batman, obviously, and I am psychotic. I was in a psych ward for three years, and I the accomplice of a murderer. The festival will be held on May 7th during both lunches. I love per performing and seeing all the performances on stage is really awesome. Yeah, I think it's a really good idea. Like, I've been in the theater club for four years and for the past three years, we've basically only been doing improv games and that sort of thing. So the fact that Mr. Fees had thought to maybe use scripts and let us really form a performance rather than just make it up on the spot, it's a good idea and it's going to be really influential for life. Well, that's all from us, Big Spring. I'm Kara. And I'm Emily. And this is us signing off. Looking for something to read for SSR? Check out this book trailer brought to you by Bookends. Follow us on Twitter at BSHSCH3 to get the latest news out of Big Spring High School. 
That's a bulldog, and I'm Emily. And I'm Vince. And this is your channel for your news. Bye. I love you.